welcome to Virtual Lean Mean. My name is Sarah. I'm gonna take you through a nice 15 minute leg burner today. So nice and quick, it's gonna burn. You're not gonna need any equipment. If you do want to wear ankle weights, <laughs> hats off to you. You can definitely put them on. Otherwise, we'll get started because we don't have long. So we'll begin with a nice stretch. Just quickly stretching out the back of your legs. So finding your downward dog for me. Just pedaling through the feet, nice and slowly. Taking that nice big inhale through the nose, exhale out through the mouth. On that next exhale, slowly come down, find your high plank. Hold, lift up through the belly. Inhale, press back. Exhale, pull forward. Inhale, press back. Good, exhale forward. Inhale back, keep this going. We're gonna to start to take it into a crawl out. So on the next downward dog, let's walk those hands in towards the feet. Take that big rise at the top. Come all the way down, find that push up. Good, rise at the top. If you wanna take that push up on your toes or your knees, completely up to you. As long as you're bracing that core nice and strong. Keep going. Good. Crawling all the way down. Nice big push up. Good. Just a couple more here. See if you can get these on your toes, especially because we're working legs the rest of the time. Try and challenge yourself to those push-ups. Good, the next time you're down there, take that push-up, hold that plank, tiny little rocks back and forth. Four, five, four, three, two, and one. Press it back. Let's walk those hands in towards the feet. Slow roll up. All right, we're gonna get our timer. We're gonna start with a plie. So when you're ready, take those feet wide. We're gonna turn those toes out. So we're gonna start to work those inner thighs. So as soon as you're ready, lower and lift. Every time you lift, I want you to think about drawing those inner thighs up together. So squeezing them in towards you. Getting nice and low. Now that bottom's not sitting back. So we're keeping that bottom tucked under. So that back is nice and tall. If you wanna think about it like you've got that wall behind you. Just sliding down nice and straight. But the lower you can get, the better. Good, in five seconds, we're gonna hold it down for little pulses. In three, two, hold it down, little pulses. You can take your hands wherever you like. So with your pulses, I want you to stay low. So try not to lift all the way up. I know it can be tempting. My inner thighs are already burning, I don't know about you. <laughs> but it's such a good little 15 minute workout. You can fit this in on your lunch break anytime. So there's no excuses to get that little sweat. Whew. All right, we have 20 seconds here. See if you can get a little lower. Find that challenge. 10 seconds. Four, four, three, two, and one. Straight into your narrow squat hold. Hold it here. From here, we're just gonna step that right leg out. In, out, in. So our bottom's sitting back. We're coming into that narrow squat. 
Now, every time you bring that leg in, I don't want you to stand. I want you to stay low. So try and keep that depth if you can. So it's just the right leg. That left leg stays still. Sitting that bottom back. We've got 20 more seconds. Then we're gonna find a lateral lunge on the right leg. Good, keep it going. We've got five more seconds before that lateral lunge. In three, two, and one. Just that right leg. Now make sure you're sitting that bottom back. You want that knee to stay over that ankle. So that weight shouldn't be forward, it should be pressing back. Halfway here. In 10 seconds, you're gonna to come to lie on your left side. So that right leg staying on top. In three, two, and one. And start to lift and lower that top leg as soon as you're ready. Point those toes away from you. Lift and lower. If you wanna lie all the way down, you can lie down. Just make sure you're creating that little gap between your waist and the mat. So I don't want any sinking of that waist into the mat. You wanna keep that core activated the whole time. Halfway here. I want you to keep reaching those toes away from you as much as possible. Could use that breath, I'm already starting to burn. Good, your hips shouldn't be rocking. Stay nice and still through the waist. Good, we're gonna hold it up in four, three, Two, let's hold it up, little circles here. I want you to keep reaching those toes away from you. I know it burns. <laughs> it's burning for me as well. <sighs> keep finding the length through the leg. Try not to rock those hips. Start to reverse those circles in the opposite direction. Good, can you try and keep that leg hip high? I can feel my leg falling. <laughs> See if you can pick it up. You have 15 seconds here. Then I'm gonna draw that knee in towards the chest in 10. Keep squeezing from your bottom, try not to move from your knee for three. For two, draw it in, press it back. In, back, keep pointing with the toes, lengthen through the leg. Good, every time you reach that leg back behind you, take a little squeeze. So you get that underneath part of your bottom. <sighs> 20 seconds here. <sighs> oh, I'm so close, 10 to go. Good, we have four more here. For three, coming onto your back in two. We've got one minute of bicycles here. Nice and slow and controlled, reaching up and across. So we're just breaking up those legs with a little bit of core. Good, reaching up and over every time. 
Good. You can reach that shoulder blade a little further up off your mat. You have 20 seconds here. And then we're coming straight back up into that squat on that left side. In five, four, three, two, and one. Straight back up. Now our squat, we're just gonna step out and in. That left side. Good, we've just got this side to go. Sitting nice and low. Remember not to come up as you step out to the side. Oh, time has vanished. Good, wherever you wanna put those hands, is fine. So whatever suits you best. Good, you've got 20 seconds to go. Ten more here. And then we're coming into that lateral lunge on the left. Whew. In three. Two, and one. So remember, sit that bottom back. Knee stays over that ankle. Can you get a little deeper? Keep that knee facing forward over that second or third toe. So we want to make sure that it's tracking. <sighs> 20 seconds here. And then we're going to come to lie on our side. Left leg's going to be on top. In 10 seconds. In three, two, and one. Come to lie on your right side. As soon as you're there, lift and lower. So remember, you can either lie all the way down or you can be up on that forearm. So as long as you can control and engage your core, then you can take whatever position you like. And I want you to reach that leg away from you. So we want to think about lengthening through the body, growing longer. Try not to shorten through the waist. Go keep squeezing that tummy in. Point those toes away. We have 10 more seconds. And then we're coming into those beloved little circles. They kill me the most. In three, two, little circles. I'll tell you when to reverse. Now the main thing here is to try and keep the hips stable. And so you'll notice if you try and make those circles too big, that your hips start to rock. So you wanna keep them really small in order to keep that precision, keep that form. You have 10 more seconds here. And then we're gonna reverse those circles in three, two, let's take them the other way. You're doing so well. We're almost at the end. We've got one more minute after this. We're gonna to start to bring it in towards the chest in three, two, bring it in, sweep it back. Remember that sweep is small, so we don't wanna arch through the back. If you feel your back arching, maybe not take that 
Don't take that leg as far back. Try and keep that knee at hip height, so try not to let it come down. So keep it high if you can. I've decided we're gonna do one last minute of pulses in that plie again, because it's so good at working those inner thighs. So after this, we're gonna get up for our last minute, and then I promise we're done. Who knew 15 minutes could burn? Well, we do now. 10 seconds here. Keep pointing those toes. For three, we're gonna come up in two. And one, straight away, feet turned out, find that plie pulse. If you want a challenge, you're gonna to start to take those little heel lifts. So one heel lift, then the other. Ooh. Can you sink a little deeper? Good, we're halfway, you've got 30 seconds. If you're not already lifting those heels, I'm gonna challenge you. See if you can find that lift. 20 seconds. Get low, get low, get low. Can you get a little lower? Keep pressing those knees back. For four. Three, two, and one. Oh my goodness. Oh, let's take a little breather there. Let's take a little stretch through the legs. Find that lunge, press those hips forward. Maybe you reach that arm up and over. And then just stand, find that. Hamstring stretch. Take it to the other side. Reach it up and over. Stand, take that hamstring stretch. Try and straighten that front leg as much as you can. And then walk those feet together. Take a little bend and stretch. And then take a roll all the way up to stand. Nice and slow. And you guys are all done. Well done. I hope you enjoyed that little banner and we'll see you soon.